In this video, we will show you how to use the Instinct Solar's new app, Fish and Hunt. Let's start with fish first. Here are how to start activity, log a catch, and set fish timers. To start a fish activity, enter favorite activity by pressing the start button on the upper right side and select fish. When the GPS acquiring is complete, press the start button to start fishing. Now we are ready to go on a fishing trip. If you trigger a catch, you can mark catch in history with a location information. Press start and select log catch. After 3 seconds, you can see the number of fish you caught on the upper right side which is called catch banner. If you press the up button, you can see your fishing route and the number of fish you caught. Do you want to use your timer efficiently on your fishing tree? You can set up an interval timer. In the fish activity, press start and select fish timers. In the setting, you can turn the timer on or off and set the interval time. If restart after catching is on, after you trigger a catch, the timer will go back to the set time. With the end time setting, you will be alerted to return to the dock when sunset or sunrise comes or at a specific time. If you also set reminder, the watch will remind you before the end time. So that's fish activity. How about the hunt function? Next, we will show you how to set up and use it. To start a hunt activity, press the start button on the upper right side and enter favorite activity and select hunt. When the GPS acquiring is complete, press start to start hunting. And now your hunt activity is started. If you need to make a record for certain spots such as a tree stand or an animal's blood trail etc, you can save the locations by using the save location function. Press start and select save location. Choose a category based on your situation. You can get back to the starting point by using the back to start function. Press start and select back to start. Select trackback. Then the watch will start the navigation. After completing the hunt activity, press start and scroll up to end hunt. Press start again and select save to save this activity. After the activity is saved, you can see and edit the locations if you need. And that's it! Thanks for watching! For more details, click another video or go to the Garmin Support website.